This textbook comes with three training videos which will help you gain a greater insight into how the material presented in the book may be applied to control instrumentation and acquire data from it in a laboratory environment. In the first video we show you how to connect an instrument to a PC via LAN. We first show you how to set up both the instrument and the PC and verify that the link is operating correctly. We then illustrate the use of Agilent Connection Expert to check that the bidirectional communication link is working properly. This program is also used to obtain the information that we need to create interface objects and device objects in MATLAB. Next, we move on to MATLAB and its instrument control toolbox. We first show you how to create an interface object, which is used to send commands to the instrument and receive data from it. We then take a step further and illustrate how to create a device object. We show the advantages of this approach and also how to put together a simple script to acquire a waveform from the instrument and display it on a MATLAB plot. In our second video, we go through an entire script step by step, which is used to control a high frequency adjutant oscilloscope and acquire a modulated waveform from it. The waveform is a pulsed RF signal created by mixing a square wave and a continuous wave RF signal. We use the modulating square wave as an external trigger and then acquire the pulse RF waveform. We show you the execution of the script line by line and also show the screen of the instrument in real time when appropriate. This way you can see the effects of specific commands and see the waveform as it changes on the screen. As we go through the script we explain in details most of the MATLAB functions used within it which are applicable and relevant to most test routines. We also illustrate the waveform format thoroughly before acquiring the waveform data and showing you how to unravel it into X and Y vectors which may then be plotted, stored or processed. In the last video we teach you how to create a GUI using Guide, the MATLAB's graphical user interface design environment. The principles of GUI design illustrated here may be applied to the design of any GUIs. However, in our example, we design a GUI which allows the user to set specific parameters of the instrument, acquire data from it, and then plot it in the designated plot area of the GUI window. We also explain the code created by Guide, which runs behind the GUI, and we illustrate how to add bespoke code to the GUI script. Yet again, the screen of the instrument is shown, when appropriate, to illustrate how the GUI actually works. And, as you will see, it also shows how fast the acquisition can be. At Explorer F, we believe that MATLAB and its instrument control toolbox are extremely powerful tools when it comes to instrumentation control, data acquisition and processing. And we have produced this book to help engineers and researchers get up to speed quickly with the techniques which are at the heart of this approach.